So, welcome back to another exciting adventure in the kitchen. Times are really strange at the moment, so I'm going to be passing them by making some great videos, something a little bit different here. So what we have is one large Spanish onion cut up really um, into big pieces. We've got a cup of green peas, we've got three tablespoons of ginger and garlic paste, we've got some bamboo shoots, I've got about a tablespoon of coarse chilli flakes, you can use chilli powder if you want, and what we have to the north of that is some aromat monosodium glutamate. We had about 350 gram of mushrooms, I've boiled the mushrooms, and what I've done is used the stock, and there's 1.2 litres of water there, just over because of evaporation. We've got some fresh water, best quality prawns I can buy, about 350 gram. And we're cheating a little bit. We're making Chinese curry sauce concentrate. So that's uh, going to be diluted about three to one. That's why I've got 1.2 litres of water. Let's heat a wok with four tablespoons of oil. So MSG will give you that nice takeaway taste. So you can use salt if you don't have it, not a problem, but do check your curry sauce to see how much salt they've put in there. There is some salt in the curry sauce. So we just want to have everything on a nice high heat. Give those onions a good stir just so they're softened. So let's just switch that over a moment so I can demonstrate this. There's 1.2 litres of water there. It's cloudy, like I mentioned, because I've used the water or some of the water that I've boiled the mushrooms in. So now it's just a case of putting our Chinese curry sauce into the water. That really helps keep the ingredients really simple. So you just want to, obviously it's lumpy, so you just want to stir that all out. And I'm also adding the MSG and the chili flakes. Going to give that a really good stir. I'm going to swap over and put this onto the simmer. Next, we can add our ginger and garlic. Sizzle it off, give it a good stir. So, a couple of moments later, let's add our bamboo shoots. Just heat those up. Next, we can add our mushrooms and the peas. Give it a stir and bring it back to a good heat again. That's smelling really good. Next, add the prawns. They'll only take about three minutes to cook, but remember we've got to add our curry sauce and let that all simmer down. So you just want to stir the prawns in briefly. When the curry sauce is done, make sure you stir it. You can use a whisk if you like, so it's lump free and it's a good consistency. So let's bring this to a heat now and we'll combine. So everything's really hot, including the curry sauce. So I'm just going to pour the curry sauce over. And we just need it on a gentle heat now. To just combine and it's smelling really great even though we use the shortcut curry sauce but that's just the way I want it so I'm just going to let all the um, ingredients pick up some of the great flavors and I'm going to boil that off for two minutes and it'll be ready to serve simple as that so there it is as simple as that I'm really uh, quite pleased the way that's turned out do stay tuned to the channel for more great recipes coming up. I'm really feeling Chinese food at the moment because going out to eat is a luxury and I'm not really into getting a takeaway because it's expensive and you can knock it up for, um, at home for a fraction of the price. So, really sorry about the way the world is at the moment, but um, let's all make the most of it. Stay safe.